two key messages for me to take out. The first is the, the fact it's enabled people to get to the, right to the nub of the issue. You know, whether it's greenwashing, whether it's the application of ESG, whether it's the values people use in, in taking, you know, taking part in responsible investing. So being able to explore those and get down to the core points, I think that's really important. And secondly, actually interacting with the audience and seeing the kind of willingness and the passion people have to, to make a difference, to actually act rather than just talk about it. One key reflection, I think, generally is that from the questions asked at the panel and so on, is that um, there's a lot more understanding about the nuances about of sustainable investing now. We're really, you know, the times of just ethical investing is far, are far behind us. Advisors really need different types of sustainable solutions to match different types of sustainably minded clients. It's been a fantastic event. I think, you know, for us or for me, the key takeaway has just been how people's interest in what responsible investing means has actually evolved over time. You know, we've had a lot of conversations at this event about how responsible investing has moved on from just being screens based to a much broader philosophy that embraces not just screening, but also investing in real sustainability winners that are generating strong returns through solving environmental and social issues. I think with the panel sessions, it's good to get a, you know, they give you a really good sense of how different firms approach this in a more contextual way, as opposed to how they deliver it in specific products. So it's useful for that kind of background and context on, on ESG. And what's been really interesting then is thinking about how ESG is filtering through into sort of their mentality, into the psychology and thinking about, well, how do I identify the right strategy for me what's being most uh, you know, important from both my client perspective, but also in terms of where I think there's long-term growth potential coming from that. So it's just been a, you know, a great couple of days. Mm -hmm.